So we're here in this trial. If you looked around and we look to the north here, we would see a pivot. When you see the pivot, everything from the pivot to about this ditch, which you see, is four inch on 40s. Then from there, we go three inch on 30s. And then from there, we go three inch on 40s. So we have about a 40 acre grid, 40 to 45 acre grid here. And this was some of, this is a very good productive piece of ground, but it had those little swells in it where we just hold a little water. And we, we've talked about before, it's all about the farm average. Yep. You know, it's all about making all the little holes make something. So that's what it's done. As you take, see for instance, see this ditch that runs up through here. This ditch was draining into those woods and it kind of kept what was out here off. Well now as you see, we're growing a full crop in that ditch. We don't need the ditch. The ditch is tiled through, so the water's coming off from that. Sure, if we got a huge rain, the ditch would still work, but what we're looking at here, though, in this trial is seeing where we can tile. We know four inch on 40 works. Yeah. Because people spend four inch on 60s or four inch on 50s, and then they come back and split them, you know, four inch on 30s. Like, we know this. This is a good deal. Well, now we get into the three inch world. We're doing this trial. Do we go three inch on 30s? Do we go three inch on 40s? That's what it's all about. We definitely know we can save some money on three inch tile, but can we go that route and will it pay out or do we stick with the 40s?